I'm a good reader of human behavior. Even today, I'm such an exceptional reader of human behavior. Every day, this little black cat comes into my back garden and it's always walking around this little block. So me and my girl trying to work out where this cat lives, like where the, where who owns this cat, because it's always in my garden. It's like, why, why is this cat always in my garden? So boom. So today a car alarm was going off. It was just going off, going off, going off. And um, I was looking out the window trying to work out what car it was, but it was a tree in front. So I don't know what car it was, because I'm thinking, right, this car alarm keeps going off. I'm going to go knock on this person's door, tell them. But I can't see what car it is, so I don't know whose car it is. So um, anyway, I was looking out the window and I noticed that little black cat that's always in my garden, all the gardens along here. I noticed that the black cat was in number four's garden. And the guys that were in number four, they came out into the back garden and they were stood in the back garden next to the cat. And the cat didn't run away because I've been out in my back garden and I see the cat in the back garden, it runs away. The cat did not run away and they didn't pay attention to the cat. If there's a random cat in your back garden, you're going to pay attention to it. Like you try and stroke it or whatever. Isn't it? They didn't pay attention to the cat and the cat didn't pay attention to them. So therefore, they are familiar with the cat and the cat is familiar with them. So I worked out, OK, that's their cat. Just little dumb stuff like that. I'm a very observant person. I don't miss nothing. I don't miss nothing.